come down to the lake to test out the drone because of this gorgeous, gorgeous sunset. Ricky's got the drone out, he's got a recording. This is so exciting. Look at where I'm standing right now. He's up there somewhere. <laughs> That's the sunset. He just missed it. It was gorgeous. night we spent chilling out watching Harry Potter. Then in the last half an hour before the countdown I went to the pub to hang out with my friends for the countdown and Ricky stayed back and hung out with his friends. Then I came home and we watched some more movies. It was the best quiet New Year's Eve ever. Happy New Year's everyone. What a good start to the year, honestly. Oh my God, this light. It is New Year's Day. We've just come down, Ricky's flying his drone above me. We've just come down to see my dad. I'm currently waiting for Coco because she's having a ball over here. Hi, Coco, hi. So for Christmas, we got Coco um, one of their dog 
bed things from the car so that she can come with us everywhere and she's been coming with us everywhere ever since and is loving life, absolutely loving life. Apologies for the birds, I can't shut the, those things up. But other than that, we're currently looking for um, some water. This coke is thirsty. And we're at an aquatic centre, not an aquatic centre, a um, sports centre. So surely there's some water around here somewhere. Currently looking around the bowling area, but I don't think that there's anything around here, to be honest. Oh my god, what a cute spot. We'll go over here and I'll talk to y'all out of the sun so we got better lighting. This place is so cute. Anyways, happy new year's everyone. This is so exciting. It has been the best Christmas, the best new year's, the best boxing day, the best end to the year that we have ever, ever, ever had as a family. I'm so excited. I'm thriving over here. I'm so excited to step into 2022. It is just going to be the best year ever. My son just went away, but it is going to be such a good year and I can already feel it. So I'm wishing everyone the best New Year's. I hope you guys have an amazing New Year's Day, even though this will be out after. Um, and I hope that you all had a really good Christmas. If you don't celebrate Christmas, I hope you had a really good holiday anyways. And for those of you going back to school very, very soon, I hope that you guys are thriving as well. Coco is in the bushes currently, so I'll keep it short and sweet, but we've just come down to the aquatic center. Well, I keep saying aquatic center. The sports center where I, this is the town that I used to live in. It is absolutely gorgeous, literally, absolutely beautiful. Um, so we've just come down here so that Ricky can fly his drone for a little bit because he can't fly it after dark. And as you can see, it's starting to get dark now. The sun's just about to go down. It's about 8.30. She's over here thriving, running down to Ricky. He's at the car over here. Didn't find any water over this side, so that's fun. But we'll go have a look on the other side. There's a few dogs around, so I'm just watching her at the moment. But yeah, this is a bit of an update. She is literally thriving out here. Loving life. Let me know in the comments what everyone did for New Year's. This year, I, well, this year, last year, the year before that, I worked it. 100% gonna work it because it is a $55 an hour day for me. So I'm not gonna say no to that. It was good. It was so good. What did everyone else do for their New Year's? Let me know in the comments. After that, we've just come down to uh, fly the drone again. As you saw yesterday, last night on New Year's Eve, we went down and flew the drone because the sunset was absolutely beautiful. Literally insane. Ricky's having fun with his drone above me, staring at me. I'm not going to duck this one. <laughs> Watching out for Coco, she's over here in the sun. It is literally golden hour. I'm going to sit down and take some photos. He's going to keep playing with his drone. And then we're going to head back and probably just chill for a little bit. Coco's absolutely exhausted. I was going to take her for a walk, but I don't think that I will. Ricky's battery is currently dying, so when we get home, I'm probably going to put together my Christmas video, which is going to be super, super fun. Now, I think we're going to go find some water because Coco's thirsty and she keeps running off from me. Bye. Oh, there's lots of dams. 